What is the future of the American continent? Is it to degrade rapidly in the next 50 years from combined stress of population, resource depletion of water, forests and fish, from pollution, drugs, terrorism and government corruption? Does the hemisphere have a chance to sustain itself because it has a large and fertile landmass with abundant ocean, forest and other resources? Do the citizens of the highly variable nations of the hemisphere care enough to modify their lives and patterns to keep it sustainable for the future? These are the questions asked and answered at the USA Club of Rome conference in San Miguel de Allende, Mexico, where the other hemispheric associations of the Club of Rome were invited to discuss the future. And so during this three-day meeting, we'll be talking about environmental issues, about population, about conflict, about the role of women in the hemisphere and in the world, and exciting problems that impact on today's world. And I hope that this conference will enable us to develop some plans that we can implement throughout America to help us to save ourselves from destruction and guarantee us a sustainable future. Because it is the only hemisphere left that has a chance to preserve its natural resources. The rest of them are pretty much gone in most places in the world. The topics included peace versus ethnic conflict, terrorism, drugs and government corruption, immigration, security, social issues such as women's rights, children's slavery and abuse, education, environmental issues, clean water, forests, fisheries, soil, coastlines, scientific priorities and economic issues such as poverty eradication.